Hi there, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to download your Photo Line OneNote Planner on your computer. This method works for most computers, so whether you have a PC or Mac, you can try this method. I'm working on a Windows 11 computer. Your interface may look different from mine if you're on Windows 10 or Mac, but don't worry, the download process is the same. I'll walk you all through this. The download link will take you to a page like this. You can see these files are shared with you by me. Generally, you'll get a few options for the planner, depending on which planner package you bought. In this demo, you have 2023 and 2024 planners that come in Monday and Sunday starts, and you have a work life template and sticker book. Okay. Simply choose the ones you need. And click copy to. Please make sure you select copy to. If you can't see the copy to up here, you can right click the files and select copy to. If you are still not seeing this option, you can try to refresh this page. Then click my files here, click documents. Let's copy them over here in the documents folder. You can click here to view the progress. Once it's done, click My Files on the sidebar, click the Documents folder. You'll see the planner files are right here. Let's open the 2023 planner first. Make sure you right-click on it. Open. Open in App. There are two versions of OneNote. So this one, OneNote, is the Office 365 version. It was called OneNote 2016 before, but now it's simply called OneNote. The other version is OneNote for Windows 10. If you have a Mac, unfortunately, you can only open it in OneNote for Windows 10. Actually, it's called Microsoft OneNote on Apple devices. I'll open the planner in both versions so that you can see the difference. As you can see, the OneNote app and OneNote for Windows 10 look quite different. You can try both to see which one works best for you. Here's a tip. You may notice something weird here. YW. Mm, that's my name. Um, that means I'm the author of creating these things, making these comments. You can clear all this up by going to the History tab, and click Hide Authors. On the Windows 10 version, this option is under the View tab right here.
Now let's go on to open the Word Live templates and sticker book. The Word Live templates is where you'll find all the lifestyle templates and word templates. I included instructions on how to copy these templates over to your planner file. Please do check it out. One thing I want to mention here is please always edit your planner on your computer if possible because the tablet version of OneNote has limited options. Now let's open the sticker book. Well, we have all the files loaded in our OneNote now. We can then open the planner in any other devices such as iPad, Android tablet, iPhone, Android phone, or any device that is compatible with OneNote. I'll take iPad as an example. On your iPad, you need to make sure you are signing to the same account where you save the planner. If you have just one account, you are good to go. Um, let's click more notebooks browse select the correct onedrive account documents click the planner to open it the planner file is generally in the documents folder if you can't find it check if there's a folder called OneNote notebooks they may be saved there if this method is not working for you for example you may see a message like this section can't be edited because it's in an archive format or this section is read-only. Please try the other two methods. You can find the tutorial links in the description. If none of the methods work, please do send me a message by Etsy for help. I'll help you get it to work. Thank you.